Hello everyone, and Tina is finally back. I know I haven't uploaded in like a month or so, but that's because it's been the finals week. Hopefully I'll have a better schedule for this summer just because I'm only taking one class and I have a lot more free time. So let's get into the video without any further ado and let's get started. An apology because I just realized that some parts of my video are like out of focus, so excuse that. Yeah, I just realized that some parts. Sorry. That and they towards the end of my video uh, when my camera like died and I had to charge it again and that stuff. So like you see that my face is kind of like cut out, like cut off the rest and all you can see is like my desk. Well, um, excuse that. That wasn't meant to happen and I just realized it after I was done filming. I like went back and started looking at the video and I just felt the need to add this little side note. So yeah. But I love you guys. Hope you guys understand and don't mind. But yeah. So for today's video, I decided to make a haul video again just because it's been really cold outside and I've been planning on making outfit videos and they're all for summer, but it's supposed to be warmer. It's really cold. It was like in the 50s yesterday and today it's about the same. So I'll just uh, stay home and film whatever the things I got. Some of them are not related to clothing, but hopefully you guys are going to like them just because I think they're very useful and helpful and they will help me to maintain my YouTube channel and make a better, I guess, a schedule for this summer. So let's get started. The first thing that I want to show you guys, let's start with Nordstrom. So I went to Nordstrom a while ago. All of this stuff that I have that's like all on the floor, uh, it's from um, a month or a month and a half of like purchasing stuff online and in stores. I didn't buy it all today or yesterday. It's been a while. It's more like a collective haul. So yeah, I want to start off with this beaten up <laughs> Nordstrom bag. So what I got there was um, I got two pairs of sunglasses. One of them are black and the other ones are silver, but I lost the silver ones already. I lost them, which I'm really frustrated about, but I still have the black ones and I posted a picture of them on my Instagram and it was bomb. I really like them and sunglasses for the summer. Well, next thing, since it is right here, it's I went to Mac. The thing that I got, I already used it, and I'm, I've been using it ever since I got it. I got it like a week ago. It's a highlighter. It's supposed to have a little box, but oh well. I tossed it right after I got home. So it's a highlighter. It's one of their um, oldest highlighters, like one of their signature highlighters. I would say they have some new ones, but I wanted the very like standard. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but um, this is the highlighter. It's fairly new. I mean, I just got it a week ago and I've used it several times. I really like it. It's really shimmery and like it's, I don't know if you can see it on camera right now. It's a highlighter from MAC. Honestly, favorite things about MAC are their, my personal favorite things are their lip liners and now their highlighters because this highlighter is amazing. Next thing that I got from Bloomingdale, it's this huge, well, medium brown bag, and what it has inside is one of my favorite things for this haul. It's also a cardigan, but the cardigan is from Michael Quartz. It's the perfect cardigan. It's pretty long. It's one of those, like, boyfriend cardigans. Like, they're kind of oversized, and if you guys know me, you know that I'm obsessed with oversized things, so that's one of them. Welcome to the family. Oh yeah, so I went to Bloomingdale's. Like I said, I usually shop at Bloomingdale's. <laughs> this is a sweater, but it's not from Bloomingdale's. It's actually from Abercrombie & Fitch. One of those like cashmere cutout sweaters that don't have like the actual shoulder, I guess. It's really soft and um, yeah, it's very comfortable. I love the pastel pink color. It's one of my favorite colors. It's not cropped, it's pretty long. It's long sleeve too. I don't even think I'll have enough time to go over this whole box. Ooh, it's heavy. So it's obviously, as you can see, it's a Zara bag. I mean, bag. It's a Zara box and it's huge. Ooh, uh, it came in a, like a nicely wrapped pink wrapping paper, which was really cute. So the first thing, rubber jacket, and it's so light, you guys. It's so, like, it's not one of those, like, really, really warm bomber jackets. No, it's, like, perfect for summer. Uh, it's, it's this olive green bomber jacket with golden details on them. It's this perfect green color for like every season. I think you can style it with so many things and I, I love bomber jackets. So there it is. So another baby blue thing, pants. Those are the classy kind of like one of those pants that you can wear both like heels and 
Converse shoes and like any sneakers. That's like, I bought them just because of their perfect color. I think that this color is so gorgeous and pretty. It's this t-shirt, it's one of those like signature Zara t-shirts. They always have one of those graphic shirts and it's just, it's so nice and so um, comfortable. It's really soft. Just like, I need one of those like really basic t uh, this is not a basic t-shirt, but I need some like simple t-shirts to just throw on like with jeans and like get out of the house in like less than two minutes. I need that. I'm really like debating whether you should buy, like what you should buy. If it's in baby blue, just like buy it, whatever it is. So what's next? They're huge. Well, okay, this is not as big as Zara, but the value of it is so much more. So it's uh, from Banana Republic. It's also one of my favorite stores. So the first thing that I want to show you guys is this bag. One of those like Chloe bags, the little detailing, that's what it reminds me of. I'm not going to go like into details, but this is what it is. And it's a, it's like kind of like a nude brownish color. It's just really nice. It goes with everything. So uh, like I was saying in my last video, every girl should have a pair of nude heels. You should also have a bag. And I just recently got mine and I feel like there's so much that you can style around just this one piece. So another thing that I got to actually match with this bag for like one outfit idea is this shirt. I love striped things and this is the, the simple, very classy black and white shirt. It's like not one of those shirts that you can only wear under a blazer. Actually, you can wear these with skirts and so many colorful things. So I got a lot of cool outfits planned for you guys around this top, um, this shirt. And if you have anything that's striped, that's perfect because there's so much that you can do with such What's inside is just a pair of shoes, but right now the box is empty. Uh, because I've been wearing the shoes and they are downstairs and I forgot to grab them but it's white sneakers with black leather details on them and um, they're really cool and really comfortable but basically what they are is just regular kind of like you know one of those adidas superstar ones but they're not superstar but they are kind of similar to adidas superstars but I can never find them when I do they don't ever have a size 7 it's like it's terrible so I stopped looking for them I finally gave up and now I got the new pairs of like Michael Kors ones and I actually like them a lot more just because when I tried on uh, the seven and a half or like eight for Adidas Superstars they seem so bulky and so big on my feet especially me like I'm really skinny so like all you can see is like those shoes on me and they did not really fit my <clears throat> my body you know what I mean like it's one of those things I'm really picky about my shoes and how they fit me and I didn't like how it looked on so I decided to go for the Michael Kors ones and I like them a lot more they're a lot like I guess smaller and like neater I would say they fit me so much better so but I'll show you and you'll be able to see them first thing that I want to show you guys is this Zara top fit you like stay on your shoulders only it's a really cool top it's one of my favorite things well yeah that's what the shirt is it's basically like a regular shirt but it doesn't have a top and a color so like that's what it is it's a long sleeve, it's also striped, and it's also blue. All in one, perfect. So this other um, thing that I got, that's the shirt that kind of looks like the other one, but it's solid and it's cropped. And the sleeves, just look at the sleeves. How gorgeous are they? It's so cute, it's so nice, you guys. It's one of my favorite things, and I love, like I'm the person who's obsessed with shirt so this other thing obviously a white shirt but it's not a shirt it's a dress and it's one of those dresses that have like sleeves on your waist it took me a while to figure out how to wear this but i got it you guys and it's from forever 21 it's from their contemporary line that's all i buy when i go to forever 21 contemporary if it's like contemporary then it's probably going to be a better quality and a better clothing in general so that's the dress this other thing that i got is also one of those like i guess off the shoulder off the shoulder top uh, it's also from Forever 20. It's a lot different from the other one because the other one is like more of a solid and like fitted and then this one is cropped and it's very flowy. Really not comfortable to like wear. If you're like gonna do something, a lot of running or a lot of moving with your hands and stuff, I don't recommend wearing this because it's just gonna go up. It keeps on going up so you have to always like keep on pulling it down and at least in my case that's what it is but this is a perfect top just because I think it's so girly and so nice and so cute this is a perfect thing and then the last last clothing item that I got is this top from Zara again 
well, it's like one of my favorite crop tops ever, you guys. Because it's not really cropped, it's really long for a crop one, but it's kind of like, it has this oversized style, and it makes your waist look so, so tiny, even though like my waist is pretty small, but it looks really like, that's the top, and it's it's uh, short sleeves, and it's like, it's got this pastel-ish kind of print on and it's really comfortable too you guys it's so comfortable to move around in it to do a lot of stuff so next thing that I want to show you guys are chokers from Zara and they're unnaturally big they look like dog colors to me but they're really cute this one has like a lot of like flowery kind of like studded details on it which is why I've got it that's the only reason why I got it but it comes in a set Something happened to my camera again. Well, those are the things that I'll be using a lot more than whatever I got here. So basically what they are, I'm gonna start off with this cute planner that I got. I can't live without a planner. I love planners because it, they help me so much with my schedule and I can keep track of all the things that I'm doing. Especially now, I recently started working. I'm still in training, but I'm gonna have to do a lot of planning and such. So this will come in handy. I will. I don't leave the house without a planner just because like I'm one of those people who write every single thing down. So once it's like once I don't have the planner, it's like I don't have my phone, I don't have my hands. So this is number one thing that's always in my bag. So my second thing that I got that's also related to school are these kind of like they're they're folders, but it has like three folder tabs, I guess, for like each style. This one just says ideas and it's black and then this one has goals and this one's like one of my favorites but the one that I got the reason why I got this whole set was because of this the marble how cute is that so pretty um, you can make so many insta worthy pictures with this but uh, it just says work the marble look I've never had a folder that's like this print like so they don't take up that much space in your backpack and they're just like nice and neat and they help me stay a lot more organized with all my works and papers and stuff like that it's like the last three things are books well two books that I got this one I posted it on my snapchat this one is Edgar Allan Poe and it's tales of mystery and imagination like how cool is that stop texting me and then this one is me before you this I'm so excited for the movie I'm like halfway done through the book already and it's it's one of the best books I've ever read. Yeah, just go and buy it. You're gonna like it. So that is it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed me and my rambling and talking and all that. And thank you guys so so much for watching. I love you all.